Welcome back to 10YS TV and the BAISS basketball playoffs. Our final game of the night, the second senior boys semifinal. This between the Jordan Prince William Falcons and the St. Augustine's College Big Red Machine. These teams playing to see who will advance to face the number one seeded CW Saunders Cougars who defeated the Kingsway Saints yesterday. A pair of other SAC teams have already advanced tonight. Both the junior girls and junior boys have advanced to the championship series in their respective divisions. The senior boys looking to do the same thing here. On the Prince William side, their junior boys, top seeded junior boys advance in yesterday's semifinal. So they are looking to do the same. Miller with the steal and on the break. So Miller is fouled. He will go to the line to shoot two. The five on the floor for the Big Red Machine is number four, like we mentioned, Lee Miller. Number one, Quinton Roll. Ten, Joel Butler. Fourteen, Tanaj Glinton. And 22 is Nicholas Bell. On the other side for the Falcons, you have number one, Trevon Clark. Number three, Ellery Lockhart. Five, Keno Stewart. Eleven, Kenny Reckley. And number 13, Jaqueo Kemp. Roll steps through. His floater off the glass just rims out. Rebounded by Clark. Three from Stewart is off the mark, but Falcons come up with their own with an offensive rebound. Roll gets called for his first. First team foul for St. Augustine's. Deep three from Clark is no good. Falcons continue to shoot away from long range, have yet to hit the mark. Kemp's layup is also no good. Three shots on that possession. Falcons still coming up empty so far tonight. Miller he walks. Another three, another miss. That's Reckley this time firing from the corner. Also unable to connect early. Falcons 0 for 5 so far and already going to their bench. Reckley comes out, in comes number 12, Philip Robinson. And Robinson misses his first three. Roll, full out of steam. Offensive foul. And 
that's the second foul on Roll. He will have to go to the bench early. Robinson from the corner. Ball stays with the Falcons. Kemp swings it over to Clark. Drives to the basket. Finally, the Falcons get something to drop. Just about midway here through the first quarter to get their first field goal. Big Red Machine still searching for theirs. Lefty finish from Stewart. Falcons take away another one. Clark unable to hit. The Stewart is there with the follow. And after going scoreless over the first three and a half minutes, six points on three possessions. Make that four field goals in a row. 8-0 Falcons run. Linton, his three is no good. Kemp across the timeline goes one on three. But Lockhart was there for the rebound and put back 10 unanswered for the Falcons. And the big red machine called for time. Javon Clark with that first basket, getting by a trio of defenders, and then the Falcons got out on the break. Stewart first with the finish, and Stewart again with the rebound and put back. You see Kemp there threw that one up because he thought he felt contact, thought he was fouled, made the shot anyway. Lockhart's put back capped the 10-0 run for the Falcons. Let's see how the big red machine will spawn out of that timeout. 321 still left here in the first. Sox still searching for that first field goal. Won't get it there when Cunningham misses the three. Gets his rebound. Stewart locks it. Butler looking for somewhere to go with the ball. He finds no one. And it's another Falcons turnover. Camp has that one blocked by Bell. Yeah, looking for that contact. Not there. Refs are letting them play early on. Miller foul near half court by Stewart. Cunningham gets the inbound. And Butler just dribbled right into Stewart, but luckily he couldn't handle it. Sack retains possession. It's 
Still looking to get something going in this half court set. Miller forces the issue, dishes it off to Butler. And there it is, finally, at the 2.06 mark, their first field goal. Miller, nice pass, finding Butler on the opposite side of the lane. Cunningham goes inside the belt. So the bigs for Sock giving them back-to-back -back scores, bringing an end to that run. That's gonna be a travel. Sock looking to shift this momentum. Answered those Falcons 10 points with four of their own. Cunningham over to Bell. He puts up a three. Stewart tries a three. He can't answer. Rebounded by Sack. Miller, spin move. Lefty layup, Lee Miller. Camp misses a three. Clark air ball. Miller again. And that one is blocked by Clark. Bell misses a three. Less than 20 seconds left to play here. Falcons looking to put an end to this run. Saka scored nine on answer. Clark will hold for the last shot. Attacks inside, looking for the foul, doesn't get it. The follow is good. Bakli Kadak beats the shot clock buzzer, and that's how we end the first quarter. Big Red Machine got the first free throw of the game. Falcons answered with a 10-0 run. Sack came back, responded with a 9-0 run of their own. And Kadat's follow is how this first quarter ends. 12-9, Prince Will. You see the Falcons run here. And then the big red machine responded. Started on the defensive end with Bell. And then Miller being that consummate point guard. Ian cutting out, finding the bigs inside to really get that run going. Miller with the play of the game so far. Weaving through defenders. Finishing with the left. Second quarter action rolled back into the game for Sack. He attacks right away and draws a foul. Comes up empty on that trip. That's Kamani Minis, Kamari Minis. She's me into the game now. Number six. Going to the line. She 
Shooting two, looking to extend this. Falcons lead early. Both of these fine bases deep in the stands tonight. Of course, the Big Red Machine had three teams playing this afternoon, so they're out in full force. But so are the Falcons on the other side. Min sinks both free throws, and the lead is five. Roll passes out of the trap. Gets it right back and looks to attack. Floater short. The bell is there again. Clark answers just as quickly. Now call Kadat for that foul. That'll be his first. Bell there for the putback, but Falcons pretty much got that ball right out of the net and started running because Clark beat everybody on that trip up court. Again, challenges the interior defense. Big red machine can't get it. The Kadat is there for another one. His size making a difference. Bell again. He gets his fourth bucket. Min's three. Gets his own rebound, puts it up again. Cutting out. They're gonna call a foul on this one, not sure. Who this one gets called on looked like a clean block. They're gonna say it was on Stewart. So Cunningham, beneficiary of that call, goes to the line, but he misses the first. Misses them both. Kadat soars for the rebound. Falcons come back the other way. Men's three. Kamari Men's five quick points off the bench. Falcons bench gets assessed a technical foul with this eight point lead. Upset with the last call. That foul on Stewart. Delda with the follow, eight points for him to lead all scorers. Kadat and Minz have been huge off the bench for the Falcons so far. There you see Minz with his corner three.
Falcons head coach Ernest Saunders upset at that call. from the personal foul. Miller two of two so far on this trip. Comes away two of three. So cuts the lead to six. Kemp attacking, leaving it for Kadak. Six points off the bench for Kadak. Kept hounding Miller full court, gets it to roll. Roll loses the shoot. And then a stop play. Falcons get the possession arrow. Chance for a 10 point lead here. Kemp cross court pass to Mins. Mins inside. Fouled hard. Took off. Look like his head may have bounced off the floor, but seems to be okay. He springs right up and goes to the free throw line. Mari Mins five off the bench, looking to make it seven. Sank both free throws in his first trip. This is two on this one. Here comes Miller the other way. Goes behind the back through traffic. The move worked, but he kicked it away at the last second. Either way, it's a turnover ball. Goes back to the Falcons. Here comes coming out, takes it himself. Rolls thought about three, drives baseline. Wild shot is no good. Devon Ferguson just into the game now. Roll blocks that one, but he's going to get whistled for a foul. They're hounding Ferguson up for it. Made contact. Going over his back and picks up his third. So three quick fouls for Quinton Roll. Ferguson can't convert. This 
misses them both. Ball will go. Butler's jumper is no good. Ball stays here. Inbound in to Cunningham. Stolen by Kemp. Kemp goes one on two, spin move. Floater, no good. Offensive rebound though, and Falcons will get a second. Shot opportunity on this possession. Kadat finds Stewart in the corner. His three pointer is long. Miller again tries to drive through traffic. Coughs it up. Stewart all the way to the hoop. Layup no good. Ferguson rebounds and pushes. Goes one on four and scores. Devin Ferguson. With a layup through four sack defenders. To give the Falcons a 10 point lead for the first time tonight. Butler. Shot is wild and no good. And here come the Falcons again. Ferguson. Ferguson with the up and under move. Sock calls for time. Trailing by 10. 2.36 left to play in the first half. and he will go to the line. Chance for a three-point play. Kamari Mins again. That's it to go. Eight points off the bench for Mins. Stolen by Kemp. Takes it himself and blows the layup. But Minz is there. Stolen by Camp again. Turned away by Miller. And finally the big red machine come away from that with the ball. Linton now back into the game. Stewart knocks it away. Bell puts it up quickly and scores. Bell has scored 10 of the Big Red Machine's 17 points tonight. Miller spins, floater. Jeff 
Just like that, the lead is back to single digits. Miller spin move through the lane. Floater before he gets to the Falcons' bigs. Butler misses the first. Not trying to chip away at this lead, makes the second. Nice pass inside. Kemp finding Lockhart for that bucket. Stewart misses, Lockhart inside again. Tie it up, Sack gets the possession arrow. Kemp just finding a cutting Lockhart to his left. Maybe the easiest two he'll get of the night. Mins, drive to the basket, left to layup. Kamari Mins up to 10 now, and that's Miller again. Lee Miller has had several plays tonight for the highlight reel. Doesn't get that one to go. That's how our first half ends. 10 points off the bench for Kamari Mins. He leads the Falcons to a 10-point lead at the break, 32-22 over the Big Red Machine. Looking back at the opening moments of the game when the Falcons had a 10-1 run. Lockhart with the put back and follow. Sack would respond though. Sparked by Miller, nine unanswered to get back into the game. It's been a game of runs so far in the first half. Nello, we've seen him do that spin move several times tonight. It's the play that brought this big red machine crowd to their feet.
Second half action underway. Dolphins open with possession. Mins corner three. Too strong. Ferguson nearly steals it. from Clinton Laguerre. Lead back under 10. Crossover, spin, out of control. Gets it to Stewart, who finds Mins in the corner. Falcons looking to slow things down. Stewart controlling. Lockhart drives inside, tries to feed it to Stewart. He has to reset. Stewart down the lane, fouled. He will go to the line to shoot two. may be exactly with a stagnant offense needs here. Stewart misses them both. Big opportunity here for Sack. Miller trapped in the backcourt, gets it over to Roll. Traveling. Bell. Falcons reset. A reminder, no shot clock. BISS basketball. Inside. Lockhart. Clark with another assist. Miller. Too strong for Bell. Whistle Clark for an eight second violation, directing traffic, but took his time a bit too much.
Big red machine extending that defense to the backcourt. Clark gets through it. Ball tip. Turnover goes to Sark. Roll pushes now. Front court. Throws up a wild shot. He fades across the baseline. Kemp to Clark. Lockhart there. Clark picks it up and puts in another deuce. Rebounded Ferguson here come the Falcons again. Clark puts the moves on inside. Layup is off. Gonna call Kadat for that one. Whistled for the foul. His second of the game. Just the first team foul for the Falcons. Nearly has it taken away by Clark. Got up in the air and didn't have a plan for what to do with the basketball. Luckily, Big Red Machine keep possession. Miller brushes off the screen, drives, poked away. They will keep it. Princeton Roll puts in a three from the corner. Lead is back to single digits. Ferguson will inbound to Kemp. Roll defending. Falcons have no issue taking the air out of this basketball. No shot clock. So Kemp is content to dribble all day. Mins trapped in the corner. Turnover and we go the opposite way. Possession arrow stays here with the big red machine. Under two left to play here in the third, still trailing by nine. Miller, deep three. Off the back iron, but Roll is there. He scored the last five. Shaking off that early foul trouble. Clark dishes to Lockhart. That's the fourth time we've seen Trevon Clark make that same exact play tonight. Great vision to find Lockhart. Bell is tied up, and this arrow will go to the Falcons. 
Clark has just been baiting defenders. Finding one of his cutting bigs, generally Lockhart. Behind the defense for an easy score. Lead back to nine. Ferguson pushes it ahead. Mins with the step. Misses the layup but gets his own rebound. Bell blocks it. Steps on the baseline out of bounds. Great defensive effort by Bell to prevent what looked like it was going to be an easy score. Bell puts it up. His jumper is off. One of his few misses tonight. Clark pushes and gets it to Ferguson. Makes a move. Going to call him for a double dribble. That turnover will get him sent to the bench. And Stewart, number five, checks back in. Roll pulls up for three. Bell, rebound. May look unorthodox, but it has been working tonight. 12 points for Nicholas Bell. And Sock with a chance to make it a five point lead headed into the fourth. And they can score in this possession. Three seconds left. Bell is tied up. They won't get a shot off. That is how the third quarter ends. Prince Will takes a 38 to 31 lead into the fourth quarter. Eight minutes left to find out who will meet the CW Saunders Cougars in the finals. There's Clark, the assist to Lockhart. Saw him do that later in the quarter, now getting a two of his own. Roll with his first field goal of the game. Followed it up with his second. Clark again, finding Lockhart. Those two have been connecting. Nicholas Bell, the bulk of the offense for the Big Red Machine tonight, leads this team with 12. Miller has six. Mins leads the Falcons with 10. Lockhar has eight. Kadat with six. Clark, six points, four assists. Fourth quarter underway. Cunningham starts it on a strong note. Osak. Five point lead. Mins fumbles the ball and here comes the big red machine. We're gonna call Kemp for the foul. Cunningham spin as he receives the ball. Evades Lockhart for the lead. Knocked away by Clark. And he finishes with the layup. Cunningham passes up the three. Looks for a better shot. Misses. 
There's Rule. Clark again. Steps through. of the night, but opened this fourth quarter with a couple turnovers, and now they foul a jump shooter. Nicholas Bell will go to the line. Twelve points in the sack tonight. This is the first. Momentum certainly seems to be shifted on the Big Red Machine side. Back by this crowd. A couple of turnovers from the Falcons. So Saunders trying to stop the bleeding right now. Still a five point lead. He is not happy with what he's seeing from this team to open this fourth quarter. Draws contact, and he will shoot too. Offense unable to get anything going. Gets the rebound. Loses the handle on the layup, and here comes Miller. He has it tipped away, and he is fouled. Miller took a shot to the face. to be okay and we'll head to the line.
second, but this lead is just four. And now another turnover. Miller ahead to roll. And he is fouled. That is going to be it. For Kino Stewart, he fouls out. and it's a two-point Falcons lead. Kemp nearly has it stolen, but finds Lockhart. Lockhart now with 10. Empty trip to the line and a bad foul in the backcourt. Ferguson pushes it across the timeline. Miller tipped it away right at the last second. Gets it ahead to Bell. Clark tries to draw the charge, doesn't get it. Just gets it over the timeline to beat the eight second violation. Kemp attacks. Miller. Reverse layup is good. Stolen by Bell. Roll, pull up Jay. This game is tied. Stolen by Cunningham. Sock with a chance to take their first lead since the score was 1-0. Defensively has paid huge dividends for Sock. His life creating a problem.
221 left to play tie ball game. Falcons have led by as much as nine. Sox only lead of the game. And now they get their first lead since the opening possession. Rolls second three of the game. Kemp steps through. Answers. away from the scrum with the ball and here comes Kemp. Gets it ahead to Clark all by himself. Miller races ahead of the pack. Layup just rims out. K.O. Kemp with the score and then the assist to Clark. Regaining a one-point lead. Clark gets it ahead to Mins. And he finishes six points in a row for the Falcons. Roll open for three. Lockhart wrestles it away from Bell. Here come the Falcons again. Clark goes one-on-one -on -one with Roll. Draws contact, doesn't get the foul, but he makes the layup. The Falcons have had an answer for every big red machine run tonight. Well, another two inside. Fourteen now for Belt. Kemp dishes to Mins. This big red, this Falcons by court rather, has been huge down the stretch. Cunningham misses a three, but gets his own rebound. That shot doesn't go. Kemp and Clark have been responsible for every score or assist during this eight point stretch for the Falcons. Rolls fought about three, Lins closes out, drives into traffic. That shot is off, Lockhart rebounds. Under two minutes left now, Clark again ahead of the field and now he gets the foul call. That one will not count. Somehow Clark got that one to go falling away from the basket. Time out. Under two minutes left to play. Falcons lead by five. Roll with his second three of the game and right when the Falcons seem to be on the ropes. Ake responded with eight in a row. Scores from Kemp, Clark, Minns, and Clark again. Bell right now, a game, a team high 14 to lead the Big Red Machine. Both Bell and Roll part have 14. Miller 
has eight. Ferguson to inbound. Big possession here for the Falcons, leading by five. Under two minutes left to play. No shot clock, so they can hold it. Clark throws it away. Right into the hands of Rowe. Huge opportunity here for Sack. Miller controlling up top. Closing out on Rowe after he made a couple threes. Miller went to that spin move, and Roll shoots an air ball on that one. Definitely wants that one back. You saw his reaction. Didn't feel good coming off the hands. Lockhart just sees it rims out. Under a minute left to play now. Big Red Machine will have to operate quickly. Miller, Cunningham. That shot is good. A three for Cunningham cuts this lead to two. Lockhart inside. Count the basket and he will go to the line. Lockhart. Perfect possession there for the Falcons. They get to milk the clock. Come up with a huge score. Doesn't convert the three-point plate. This lead is four. Miller. Stolen by Clark, and that should do it. Trevon Clark with the steal, fast break layup. To give the Falcons a six point lead. They are just going to dribble out the clock here, and the Prince William Falcons have advanced. They will face the CW Saunders Cougars in the Senior Boys Final. Mari Mins finished with 14. Clark also finished with 14. Lockhart finishes with 12. 6 4. Bakley Kadat. On the big red machine side, Nicholas Bell and Quinton Roll both finished with 14. Miller finishes with 8. That'll do it for 10 YSTV and our coverage of the BISS Basketball Championship Series. BISS playoffs, rather. We'll see you on February 6th for game ones in all divisions. <laughs>